All right, Sharon, thanks a lot. Here's what people are talking about this morning. Two teens are behind bars charged with beating another teenager to death. Police say 14-year-old Christopher Jones was attacked while riding his bike in Crofton in broad daylight. Eyewitness News is live. Mike Shu has the latest on the police investigation. Good morning, Mike. Good morning, Jessica. Eyewitness News has learned that one of the teens now in police custody lives less than a mile from the crime scene. As you'd expect, emotions are still raw for those who knew and loved 14-year-old Christopher David Jones. Many wept at the site on Nantucket Drive in Crofton, where he was viciously beaten and killed. I've lived in Crofton for 34 years. I've raised two boys here. Never ever did we worry about our children being outside in broad daylight. Investigators tell WJZ a group of five to seven teenagers targeted Jones, pulled him from his bike, and attacked him just after 4 o'clock Saturday afternoon. It's just sad that somebody can take somebody's life like that mm -hmm. and beat somebody so bad for probably no reason. It's no reason. Mm -hmm. It's senseless. Police have arrested two teenagers, 16-year-old Havel George and a 14-year-old who they declined to identify. George will be charged as an adult with manslaughter, second-degree assault, and reckless endangerment. The 14-year-old faces the same crimes, but as a juvenile. A family friend says those responsible did not like Jones's friends and attacked him when they found him alone. Who's 14? What could he have been doing that he deserved to die? Now, police have officially not said what they believe the motive to be. An autopsy shows that the 14-year-old died of severe neck and head injuries. Reporting live downtown, Mike Shew, WJZ Eyewitness News, sending it back to you, Jessica, on TV Hill. All right, Mike, thanks a lot. A Baltimore City business owner.